Welcome to our list and label tutorial. In this detailed step-by-step -step guide, we will take you through the process of creating an order list using the report designer. From setting up your project to customizing the layout and integrating data sources, we'll cover all the essentials you need to know. First let's add a personal touch with your company logo. Navigate to Insert and select Picture. Then draw the desired size on your workspace. You can load your logo from a file or define it with a formula. Next, let's add a title to your report. Go to Text and draw a text box. Use the formula wizard to enter your title. For example, order list. Double click the object to set its properties, such as font size. Now it's time to create our order list. First, navigate to the insert menu at the top of your screen. From here, select report container. Now click and drag in the workspace to define the size of your container. Once the report container is in place, you'll be prompted to choose an element type. Select table as your element. This table will serve as the backbone of your order list. Next, it's time to connect your table to your data. You'll need to specify the database table that contains your order information. This step is crucial for fetching the right data for your list. For this report, we'll choose orders as data source. With your data source connected, choose the fields you wish to display in your order list, such as order dates, customer, address, city, and country. After setting up the columns, you can fine tune your table by adjusting column widths. You can rename column titles like changing customer ID to customer. And you can format the background. As well as the fonts. This is your chance to make the order list visually appealing and informative. Finally, preview your report to see your order list in action. Make any necessary adjustments to ensure your data is presented clearly and accurately. And there you have it. You've successfully created an order list in list and label. With these simple steps, you can enhance your reports with detailed and organized order lists. Thank you for watching our tutorial. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks on making the most out of list and label. Happy reporting!